The concept of automation is present in many forms within Geomagic Control X. Depending on the needs of the user, automation can be as simple as rerunning the same program on multiple scans of similar parts for repeated inspection, or it could be a fully customized process using visual scripting. The pairing manager is at the core of all of the automation within Control X. This command requires an alignment between the measured and referenced data, which is usually the initial alignment for scanning only workflows or the adaptive alignment when a probing device is used. Using that pre-alignment, Control X can infer geometric entities in the measured data and pair them with reference data features, either CAD faces or mesh regions. The user has full control over how measured data is paired with reference features, with options for filtering points based on their statistical relevance to the extracted geometry and overall distance from the reference part, an exclusion zone for points near the surface boundary or edge, and several others. These parameters can be global to all reference features or assigned on faces individually or in groups. Once the pairing manager is assigned and measured points to reference features in the background, all existing alignments, datums, dimensions, GD&T callouts, etc. can be calculated instantly. After an inspection program has been created in Control X, it's easy to apply the process to new scans by right-clicking the Measured Data group in the Model Manager and selecting the Replace Measured Data option, then browsing to a new file and selecting Run Inspection Process. Because the Pairing Manager automates the extraction of measurable features from scan data and intelligently links the digital twin to its nominal reference file, other tools can expand on this ability. The Batch Process command allows a user to point multiple scans to the same inspection program to analyze a group of parts without an operator having to load each scan into the software individually. Reporting options include the standard PDF, PowerPoint, and Excel formats, which can be sent directly to a document printer or saved to file. An XML file for each scan that can be compiled into a trend analysis report later is another option, and a Control X project file for each scan can be saved for future analysis by an operator if desired. Scan processing automation in Control X is handled in the Model Manager, where the scan process designer allows a user to create custom macros that can align, clean, and process incoming raw scan data into workable objects to compare against a reference, or to export for use outside of Control X. Scan processes are one action item that can be utilized by the visual scripting tool in a custom workflow. Visual scripting is a simpler means of defining custom workflows within Control X than the legacy Python scripting console. A visual script can be triggered by the automation server when it detects a new scan has been moved to or created in a specific folder. The core function of the automation server, however, is to define rules that pair measured data scans with their relevant Control X program by name, and then monitor a specific folder for those scans. When a new scan is detected, the server assigns a client PC, which could be itself or another external machine, to open the Control X project, import the new scan, and run the program then save the report generated to another specified folder. The server will then reset and wait until a new scan is detected and repeat that process. This is the most flexible option for higher throughput when scan data from a variety of parts is being collected by automated means. There's a ton of advanced functionality built into Geomagic Control X that offload manual tasks from the user. There are more options than ever to let the software do the heavy lifting in your inspection workflows. So let us know it's wasting your technician's time and we'll show you how to automate it. Thanks for watching.